What's cracking, everybody? Welcome to Boo TV. While you're here, do me a big favor and like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell so you stay notified whenever we upload a new video. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate you for watching. Thanks for the support. And let's get into the topic for today. The Charlotte Hornets lost to the Los Angeles Clippers 105 to 126 in LA. LaMelo Ball in 37 minutes of play had 25 points on 10 for 26 shooting, not good. On 4 for 13 from three point land, not good. But he did chip in with 11 rebounds, 12 assists, two steals for a 25 point triple double. All right, let's check out these highlights. The Great Washington dime there to the corner baseline. I love, I love LaMelo's ability to pass the basketball. I just love his game all around. Um, he's, 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 he's hella fun to watch, man. Hella fun to watch. Great left hand finish. Defender all over him. But the Charlotte Hornets, they're going to have to put some more players around them, especially that they lost Miles Bridges. So that, that really set the team back. Oh, great. No look. Shovel pass. Okay. 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 Six foot eight, man. Oh, he's saucy with it. <laughs> Bro, six foot eight. I'm trying to think if I've ever seen a better ball handler at six eight. There we go, right there. Good offense, right there. Good moving the basketball. Good moving without the basketball. Great spot up jump shot right there by Lamelo. Look at that bullet pass. Defender, uh, PG-13, nearly grabbed that, but just whizzed right by his fingertips. Hell of a pass. Good finish by Plumlee. Takes the screen, finds the open shooter, bang, bang, boogie. Reggie got a couple of games off uh, with a little bit of an Achilles. Injury. That's a floater from the free throw line. My word. Okay, I like that action right there. I love that action right there. Oubre right there. Money. Great pass. Because Luke doesn't want to be selfish. He says if he takes 87 to 60, Clippers out in front. If I'm not mistaken, Luke Kennard, all-time leader in <laughs> Oh, my God. The passes are saucy, bro. Saucy wassy. Maybe it's just me, but I think when this roster is fully healthy, it's... His jump shot looks so weird, but it works. It goes in. Oh, my God. The step back. Oh god, that was a, a pivot point stop step back. Yeah, that was a nice little move right there because I think for a split second, might have been caught in between passing and shooting, but his ability to just slow down mid gather uh, really threw the defender off and was able to finish with the left hand with no contest because the defender was extremely confused as to what he was doing and didn't want to commit either way. Buckets. Reorganizes and cashes in off the bounce. Washington in the corner of the ball. Oh my God! Great pass and great ability just to to tightrope that man. Didn't have a whole lot of space to uh to maneuver, but he's silky smooth with his movements. Kelly turns the corner on Jackson. Good left hand by Kelly Oubre. Yeah, I really, I really, really, really love watching Lamelo go to work, but um. You know, I watched a good portion of that game, and he missed some easy, easy jump shots. He missed some layups as well. 
Um, you know, I'm going hearkening on that 10 for 26 shooting, 4 for 13 shooting. He's not a amazing three point shooter. Like he's okay to decent most nights. Uh, every time he shoots a three, I don't expect it to go in. He's not that caliber. So I think 13 three point attempts are a bit too much unless you're really hitting. Um, but definitely would like to see him shoot a better percentage from the field. One thing I was saying in my previous LaMelo videos is that I'd like to see him be more aggressive, taking more shots. And here we got that in this game. But he wasn't hitting them with consistency. I watched that game. A lot of the Charlotte Hornets players, not just LaMelo, a lot of Hornets players were missing easy shots at the basket. They're missing lots of layups, lots of layups, lots of easy buckets. LaMelo Ball included. And LaMelo had some easy open jumpers as well that he that he completely missed so would like to see a better shooting performance but uh other than that he played pretty phenomenally with the exception of his seven turnovers we definitely it's way too many turnovers don't need that that's like trey young territory right there don't need that many turnovers but his passes were on point he was out there grabbing the rebounds um so you know shooting wise turnover wise we can do better but overall Solid performance. Uh, the Clippers are really picking up momentum now that Kawhi Leonard's um, playing more games. So that was my finals. That was my championship pick, the Clippers. So I'm sticking with them. But, um, yeah, the, the Charlotte Hornets are going to need to uh, make some moves this season and in the offseason because they definitely took a step back with LaMelo Ball being injured the, so much at the beginning of the season and then losing Bridges. So we'll see. Let me know what you think about it, guys. Appreciate you. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, and catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching. We out, baby.